Hey guys, it's your girl Jess over here from Ms. Jess Productions. And we're going to play a little Road 96. In my previous video, we left off finishing episode 1. And I won't give away any spoilers as to what happened to the very first runaway that we played as. Uh, you'll have to go back to my channel and watch the two-part episode. Yep, there's two parts uh, covering episode one and what happened from the journey from start to finish for the very first runaway of the game. Now we're going to dive into episode two and continue the game as a different runaway and see if we can have a different outcome. Now, some of you might have already noticed that there's a bit of a spoiler from the first episode. But, you know, go back to my channel, just watch the video, and you can see what actually took place and how we got to where we were, we were at. And let's start as a new runaway. Thank Hello, you for joining me, Sonia by the way. Sanchez here. Welcome to the Sonia Show. The election is coming up. And this past weekend, I had the opportunity to attend a rally for Tyrak, which was open to all his supporters. What an amazing and wholesome event it was, with non-alcoholic refreshments and entertainment for the whole family. Thank you, Mr. President, for such a wonderful event. Our nation is blessed to have you at the helm. And here's to hoping for at least 10 more years with you. Security at the border has been elevated after a team was caught trying to cross hidden in the back of a commercial truck. The team, <laughs> as well as the truck well, driver, that's, has been that's a spoiler alert from episode now, one. Let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate polls. Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. What a relief. We need to as get that know, number down for the Tyrak. Show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. So after each Remember, episode you, you complete have any information, please call the Sonia hotline. You're going to see these broadcasts. And in the broadcast, it'll recap what happened in the episode you just finished previous. So since we're in episode report. 2 now, this broadcast talked about events that took place in episode one. So that's pretty interesting how they um, the tie it in. And now we're going to pick one of these three teens to play as Let's this time around. Back home. I like to go with the one who has the most money because that's uh, not the easiest thing to come across from my experience. Although I did really well in episode one with money and then, you know. Well, you can watch the video and see what happened for yourself, but we're going to choose this teen and, and that has been the Sonya see what this person's journey will be. We have 1,752 miles to get to the border. Will we make it? And if we do, who will we meet along the way? What kind of surprises are in store for us, guys? Okay, we begin this episode on June 25th, 1996, and it's called Let's Get Serious. Alright, this is where we're, can we go in here? Probably not. Nope. Okay, this location does not look like one we have been to since the last episode. Ooh, what do we have here, guys? What do we have here? Let's do a little exploring around and see if we can find any hidden food, car keys, money, anything that we really could use, to be honest. Our energy level is not great starting this game, so that's going to be my focus, is trying to get that up. Because the last thing we want to do is pass out or die. I don't know if we can, like, die from starvation or not. 
I don't want to test that theory out though. Oh, cannot check trash. That sucks. Cannot use the ATM. Okay, I don't see any hidden anything really. We cannot unlock or pick the lock. That's the great brigade secret symbol. And we cannot do a free nappy nap there to get our energy up, so... Hmm. Oh! There's a nappy nap place right here, but... No option to use it. Okay. Well... I don't know, guys. Our energy's low. What do we do? Uh -uh. Chucks isn't open right now. Renovation. But there's people in there, dude. And I have to pee. Music? No, you don't. The sea people, dude. You and that skinny guy. Go on. But make it quick. Ooh, he's letting us in. I win! Hand over those bills, Robert. Well, I'm out. Anyone else want a shot at this guy? Uh-huh. Not me. Papa Bear's man than air hockey back from Satan. <laughs> oh, air hockey. Good Wait times. Teams, all of you. But what about you, kid? You talking to me? Oh, you want me to play? Alright. We've got ourselves a I'm down. Let's do this. Don't need to threaten me with a good time. <laughs> What you got, John? Let's do this. I did this in episode one, so I'm a little familiar. A little bit. I did score on myself in episode one, though, so... <gasps> oh no! He got me. No, I don't want him to beat me. I want to win. Alright. Score one for Jess. Let's keep those positive vibes going. And get another point, guys. Oh no. Scored on myself. I knew that was coming. That sucks. Oh, uh, it's gonna be a nail biter. Who's gonna get it? Me or John? Root me on, guys. We need those positive vibes. Oh. Yes. I knew it. The kid's a winner. I don't the kid is a winner. Like one bit, but you winner, winner, winner chicken dinner. Thanks, John. Appreciate the money. Now can I take Come a nap? I need on. rest. Sure you're not on the Olympic squad? Or some food. Okay. Um, this co could potentially be a dangerous situation depending on how I answer, so we're going to keep these guys happy and placate them no matter what we need to say. Yep, Chucks is our official hangout. Don't go telling the pigs. It's cooler than it looks, young blood. Believe me. Oh, you're not. It's just that John's still living in the past. Chuck! Serve this boy a martyr. Here we go. You sure a about martyr. That oh no. Is practically an adult, aren't you? Are they buying it? Oh yeah, they are. Okay, so I have no choice. I can't move. I have to take the drink. Now, 
Is it gonna be like Alice in Wonderland? <coughs> and like maybe I grow bigger or smaller? Or am I gonna pass the F out? Like I'm a little nervous, so I don't know. Bottoms up. Okay, I seem to be okay. We ask? definitely want to know the answer to that. Um. Right on, right on. You and me are alike then. Well, you gotta eat, drink, and get your rest, kid. You can't stop I the know. basics just because you're on an adventure. You know what I mean? He gave me a drink and it gave me no energy. My name is Robert, kid. Nice to meet you. You know, I do believe there's a reason you're here today. <clears throat> what are you gonna make me a murder? On, young bud. It's getting late. In actuality, not just in a drink? Oh no. What's going on? Okay? Oh, oh, he got me. He got me, guys. I got roofied. Oh no. Some time later. Oh great, and I have even less energy. Kid, wake up. Wake up. Yes, Robert. What did you do to me? Murders are good. Uh, I'm alive, so I guess they are. I see. Come on. I want to show you something. Something big. That's not the first time a dude said that to me, you know. And usually they be lying. I can't move. Robert, I can't move. Welcome to the brigade's secret hideout. <gasps> okay, I can move now. Oh, look, there's food. Hell yeah. That's a good thing, because my meter was low. Uh, can I go in that door? We will take this money. We will open this drawer, and we will take these keys. Oh, yeah. Alright, let's move the book. See what this place is about. John and I were at the border in '86. The brigades have been around for many years. Who will allow me to vandalize that one? No options here to pick from. Nothing to loot. Yeah, this. What's the kid doing here, Robert? He said he was going to show me something big. And it's a room full of people. The kid's political. Besides, I'm going to look out for fresh blood. Because you never know where we're going to be stuck next. I cannot take anything. See? He's not going to say a word. I'll start the meeting. Look, it's now or never to elevate our game. I have a plan to rig a Tyrak billboard. We'll attract cops to it by broadcasting a fake signal. When they arrive, boom, we trigger the device. This isn't a huge move, but it's a good start and will send a strong message. Do I have any volunteers? Oh, they're gonna try to get me to do this full hearty stuff. Nonsense, I don't wanna do it. Don't get me involved. Dude, I am totally trying to get to the border. I don't like this. I won't volunteer. I'll keep silent. I'll do it, Robert. This isn't who we are. They're sending teens to the work camp, John. Protests aren't cutting it. And Flores sure as hell won't cut it either. Robert's right. We need to attack. Now. Alex, our little genius, will help us rig the device. If all goes well, he can build us something bigger and badder for election day. We met Kids Alex out, in episode one. He doesn't want to be involved in this. We don't need Alex. We can find somebody else to do this. I'm telling you all, violence will do more harm than good. Funny, don't you think, kid? 
I don't think it's funny. Funny because John and his girlfriend <laughs> were the ones who drove the truck to kill Tyrak in 86. Ooh. I've changed, Robert. Yes, That's a juicy tidbit have. of info. Look, we should vote and settle this right now. Who thinks the brigades need to be more aggressive? I don't. I do. I do. I refrain. I don't. I don't. I do. Free against free. Let's ask the kid. He's here after all. Oh. That's why you brought him in. To vote on your side. Incredible. So what are we voting for exactly? Attack. Violence is not the answer. Or I am not going to vote. Well. How do we keep these people happy? Um, we're going to go with. Violence is not the answer. You blew it, kid. I thought you had the makings of a real brigade. Oh, don't guilt trip me into nothing. I don't believe in violence. If you can't solve things with your brain, you shouldn't play the game. The police on their way. We all know what we need to do. Get in our cars and leave calmly. Kid, no need to worry. They'll never suspect you. Hey kid, wanna play? We can put down some money if you want. Nope, I cannot afford to bet what little money I have. I need what can to I do for you, kid? eat. Uh, I don't know anything about Florence. She's a moderate. Even if she keeps her word, it's not the change we need. Let's get a drink. And that'll buy us a little more energy. And let's see if we can scope things around and find more things. Quite possibly or quite po Ooh, we can open this one. Oh, what's this? Found a cassette tape! Uh, what does that mean? Somebody's going potty. All right, good times. I'm glad I checked in there because we found a cassette tape that won't allow us to go in. Ooh, is there anything in here? And now we can't get back into the brigade room. It will not allow us to move the book. To move that shelf to get downstairs. I think if I had chosen violence was the answer to here, fight, kid. maybe we would have had access. But that's not how the cookie crumbled, so I think our time here is done. There's nothing else to collect, it looks like. All the cars are gone. Meeting is clearly over. I do have car keys. Can we use this? Yes, we can use it now. Yay, we need this rest because our energy is not great. Hey guys, thanks for sticking around and listening to your girl Jess playing Road 96 doing episode two currently and if you haven't caught up on episode one go back on my channel and check it out there's actually two videos covering episode one all right so we got our nap in and we have a little more energy it's not quite full and we have a few different options to progress we can call a taxi hitchhike walk I believe I stole keys for this though, so. Oh, didn't I? I thought I stole keys. What the hell? I guess not. So, what are we gonna do? Should we hitch hitchhike? Nah, we'll walk. So, I feel like if we hitchhike, we might get somebody that might wanna, like, murder us. And I don't wanna die.
Okay, she, he walked a good distance. It is June 26th, 1996 in the game. We're playing episode two. This chapter is Video Killed the Radio Star. Another pop culture nod. Episode one, we played something called Smells Like Teen Spirit, which was clearly a nod to Nirvana. And now we got Radio Killed the Superstar. What shall we come across? I hear music. Cannot check the trash. What do we have going on? Oh, there's Sonya's limo, maybe. There's actually a couple limos. But I believe that white one is Sonya Sanchez's, because we did that in the last episode. Just looking for stuff in case there's hidden keys or cassette tapes, you never know. Okay, we all know the plan, right? Yes, totally. Let's do this. Check, 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 uh, check, check, guys, check. is it me? Or is that kid over there listening to us? Nothing to see here, kid. Oh, you guys are up to something. Let me in. Get Wanna lost, help? Kid. No. You don't even know me. Why are you excluding me? Let me help. Nothing to see here, kid. Why is everybody so mean to me all the time? I swear. Where is he, Sonia? It's almost time. Well, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I insulted him one time too many. Look, Whoa. I had someone to film this, and now you know <laughs> it how made me this do is to Where I am I going to find a loser to... Oh, hey, hi, Sonia. It's your lucky day. Sonia has a job for you. I like jobs. I could use the money. Perfect. Then you're my new camera operator. Now get behind the camera. Time to make some effing magic. Yes, ma'am. Let's make some effing magic. This is just a little puff piece on the pump, Cuddle Muffin. Nothing to it. We have a sec if you want to, like, talk to me. I get my take on something important. Just that Tyrak puts them there to catch teens on the run. Uh, we'll go with Flores. Oh, honey, please. Flores isn't gonna do a thing because she ain't gonna win. Okay, let's go. We'll start with the intro. Oh, this is good with the billboard behind me. How do I look? <laughs> Wait, I know. Amazing. Yeah, just like that. Three, two, one. Sonia here, reporting live from the site of Petria's newest oil pump, where the Minister of Oil is moments away from a speech. The new pump. Her redneck accent just suddenly Tyrat disappears when she's on air. Y'all notice that? Nation. And cut! Oh my god, we effing destroyed that! We ain't done! But take this! Ooh, I got a lucky star. It's a new ability. I don't know what it does. Oh, it says, <laughs> duh, it tells me what it does. You're feeling lucky. All well, dice roll probabilities are increased by 15%. So it helps with your luck, I guess. It's a lucky charm. It's helped me. Maybe Thanks, help babe. You too. Appreciate you. Okay, sweetums. 
Now we film the minister. Get the crowd to cheer when he talks about President Tyrak. And boo when he talks about Senator Flores. There's Adam. Got it, ma'am. That's what I like to hear, Chunky Wonky. Okay, Chunky you know, Wonky. Film him. Hello, good citizens. We're here to celebrate the opening of this pump. Don't forget to take some close-ups. And what a beautiful and strong pump it is. Like our nation. Like our He looks president. like somebody Speaking I would never trust. Let us cheer him to show our appreciation. Nice one, Dumplin. Flores. Hey, you're paying me. I'll do whatever you tell me to do, baby cake. Take away your jobs. What do you, the hardworking people of Petria, think of Lupe Flores? Good, cutie pie. Real good. Thanks, honey bun. There's been a lot of talk of a brigade uprising. But am I worried? No. I've even let my teen daughter embark on a road trip. President Tyrak teen will daughter. keep our nation safe. Praise President daughter. Tyrak! Is that freaking Zoe's dad? Those are the protesters that we stumbled upon when we first entered this area. Oof. Well, you gave me the camera lady, and I definitely, definitely do stories like that. time to drive off in my limo. Can you give me a ride, baby cakes? Give me a ride. Give me a ride, please. Please, sugar. I, I don't want to walk. Look, to sum it up, your intro wasn't half bad. Thank In you. In fact, you did a good job the whole way. Here, wow. buy yourself a new everything. <gasps> Fifty dollars? That's gonna make me hollers. Hell yeah! Woo! We rich. All right, cool. Well, I do believe it's time to go, sweet cakes. Is her Ew. hair shorter all of a Let's sudden? Ah, uh, she really did leave. Bye, babes. Uh, we can hitchhike. I don't trust taxis after episode one, so I'm good on that. We'll hitchhike. We'll see what kind of fun we can get into. One thousand seven hundred and fifty two miles. Still got a long ways to go, peeps. Anything can happen along the way. Every choice you make alters the game in many ways really speak of the devil zoe there she is we met her in episode one with a different teenage runaway that we played as and i said it in episode one i'm gonna say it again the soundtrack for this game is amazeballs. I love it. They did a really good job on the game so far, and the music's incredible. I'm really impressed so far. I'm digging this game. And I feel like by the time we're finished with it, I'm gonna love the game and probably wanna play it again, maybe. Given all the hostility, it's normal the police would get violent. Wait, you're saying the police are justified in using violence? I'm glad you're here. Now I'm not the only one subjected to this. P 
people are looting, Jeff. What good will come of that? Looting is reasonable when the system is so broken. Do you think they always talk like this? Gross, dude. <laughs> well, All right, let's look under. Are we lucky or not? So We're about to find out. Us, yes. Right? Let's take these. What are they? Three bucks. I'll take that three dollars. What'd you say, Zoe? I knew you were a crosser, like me. I can smell it on you, literally. Thanks. Let's You're talk trying to about tell me something I else smell. then. Think they know what we're really up to? Yeah, they seem kind of with it for adults. So, I got an idea. Does it involve Connect Four? Shut up. Let's play this game I found and listen to some music. Here, take my Walkman. Yes, ma'am. Wait, have you played before? I like to know my opponent's strength before crushing them. <laughs> we want to underplay our skill because maybe it'll take it easy on us. Then this is gonna hurt. Sorry. Oh, yeah, maybe not. First to get four checkers in a row wins. Okay, I actually do suck at this game, so I'm not sure where we're gonna st just go with it. I think there's a method to my madness. Maybe not. Ooh, she blocked. Definitely blocked me. Okay. Definitely want to be careful. Crap. I knew she was going to do that. I warned y'all I suck at this game. I actually play a better game of chess than I do with this. She's setting herself up. I cannot put my thing here because she'll get four in a row. Here, girl. I got it. You beat me. Well, I suppose it was time I finally lose at something. So, do you like the music? Don't worry about hurting my feelings. I'm a big girl. I've got all kinds of tapes. Here, so you remember me. Here we got a new cassette tape, guys. It's called the Mountain Peak. Anything else we can do or loot? To start a new life. No, to have a life. My dad thinks I'm lucky to have a big house and go to a prep school, but I'm not. Believe me. Well, it is. Look, I'm gonna tell you something, okay? Maybe I shouldn't, but I feel like I can trust you. My father is the minister of oil. I believe that. We figured that out a little bit ago. Well, you should. I can't have a normal life. I can't really have a life, period. Thanks. Uh, I feel better now that I've told someone. Uh, can you go back to thinking of me like you did before? Not cool, man. Hey, kids. Uh-oh. Good luck. Can I ask you something? I was wondering, would you say you're political? Uh, no. Not really. What about you? 
Well... I thought so. I mean, isn't that why you're leaving the country? And don't deny that you are. You're leaving because you think the country has problems. For real, Jeff. <laughs> anyway, because you are leaving, you two are political, at least according to me. And? <laughs> the shame. What are you gonna do? Turn us in? Are you guys cool people? What's going on here? So since you are... Jeff! Almost done. What are you gonna do to change this place? Yes, it could bring about change, but it requires so much sacrifice. What's certain is, it's the youth who are gonna make change happen. If it happens at all. Finally, we agree on something. So the goal is to make a change Happy for the better. Happy you say that. Oh no, road control. You go oh, no. the speed limit? No, I mean, I don't think so. Oh no. Oh no. This isn't good, guys. Everyone stay calm. Look, it's Adam the Kids, driver. Let us do the talking. They seem to reuse that same dude skin over and over and over. Road control, ma'am. License and registration. <sighs> Happy to help however we can, sir. Sir, he's nothing but a road control zombie. Those Sorry. are your kids. Shut up. No, sir. Just giving them a ride. I see. Oh, great. He's coming this way. Oh, he's coming to me. Are you all right, son? You seem a little nervous. I am nervous. Say, you look like one of the kids on the missing Oh, God. Here we go. Well, just to be sure, I'll need to see your papers. What if we were to uh, I don't have make papers. a donation to road control, sir? A donation? That's a good idea. Well, for a donation, I suppose I could look the other way. Thank you, officer. Wait, wait, you're not really going to pay this guy, are you? Zoe, shut up. It's people like you that are ruining this country. Excuse me? Be no, quiet. Zoe, shut up. Oh, come on! This turd in a uniform isn't gonna do anything! That's it! You're coming with me! What have you Ooh, done, let me Zoe? out of this car so I can run. Uh, don't touch me, What pig. do we do? I need to run, forced run, oh, right no. the F out of here. Uh, oh. oh no. Stay in the car, boy. Do what he says. Okay. Great. Do I help Zoe or do I stay in the car? I need to help myself, I think. Because if we both get arrested, then the game in this episode ends, so. It was a difficult decision. But you made the right choice. Did he I? Send you to, you know where. Yeah, man. I do. I do know where. Poor Zoe, though. I hope this doesn't have disastrous consequences. But we traveled quite a distance, and we have 521 miles left to go until we reach the border. Oh no, and the dude's energy is way low. Need to find food, drink, and a place to sleep. Pronto, because I don't want to find out what the consequences of 
running out of energy would be I could just see a big old game over title screen Get your tapes and in my head. Here. Tapes and snacks. We will take food. Thanks, dude. Music goes well with the road. It's like the perfect compliment to being on a road trip. Thank you, I am not buying cassette tapes. Anything we can take? Does not look to be anything. Ooh, we have a code. Where can we find it? the code? Is there any numbers or papers laying around? Biggie's life. There's a tw uh, four digit number, 1204. Maybe we could try that in the code. Let's see if that might work. It won't work because there's no zero. Okay, so that's not the right number. Let us see if we can find a different way to get a code. Ooh, I need a nappy nap. Why is this not open? Well, that sucks. I think we have to go inside and do whatever it is we're here to do. Oh, here's another code. 11201. There's no zero on that number pad, so that's useless. I mean, the number is probably there for a reason. 11201. We have to remember that. And the other one was 1204. We have 0509. Here. Yes. An ATM we cannot use. Let's call home. Maybe mom will yeah. send us some money. Oh, we got a trophy called Homesick. Hey, Dad, it's I told me. You never to call, didn't I? Bye. Uh, yeah, that's not good. No hidden keys, no hidden food. Nothing. Wait, 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 wait. I was wrong. Look. Oh, guys, we got a credit card. Oh, snap. Can we use that in the ATM? We're about to find out. Is there anything in here to take? No. Let's go back outside real quick. What's this? Trash. What can I do for you, kid? Hold on, I'm gonna go uh, over here real quick. I'll be right back. Do 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 do. Where's that ATM at? Right there. Okay. Oh, I can use it now. Cool. Okay, so we could take 10 bucks, 60, we have a 39% chance to get 40, or we could return the card. I mean, this seems like a no-brainer. Take 60 bucks, right? Alright, can we use the card again? Negative. So the debit card is a one-time use thing. It looks like. But now we're up to 131 smackaroos. We shall get some food. 
Is that money we can take? No. Guys, look! It's an Ohio license plate that says, Dude! <laughs> like, A, I'm from Ohio, and I say dude a lot. I feel like that was made just for me. I know that's wishful thinking, but, you know. Ohio of all states? That's really rad. Oh. Uh, I'm not sure what the point of this scenario is, but let's go with it. Yeah, see an RC? Run. Got it? What's an RC? And cop working road control. You didn't know that? Man, you don't stand a chance. Um, thanks, dude. Me too. But only one of us can win, dog. The other must be sacrificed to the gods of Palm. Okay, do battle we shall. I suck at Palm. First to three wins. I don't want to beat this little twerp. He's Isn't not a twerp, he's a cute, sweet seen? kid. I like his quirky personality. We met him in episode one! Oh! He scored a point. That sucks. Yes. Oh, hell, no. hell yeah. Don't sweat the small stuff, Alex. You're going down. Might as well get used to it. There we go. Score. Okay, hell yeah. Okay. Homie sees how it is. You do, homie? Yo, yo. Check it. Chess is gonna score. Some more. And I'm a poet and didn't know it. Yes, I did. I did know it. I am a poet. Quite literally. And figuratively. Hell yeah, I win. No one's Bam! Ever beaten me. I'm gonna need a minute to process this. Do I win something? Guess I got lucky. Defeat's hard to swallow. Luckily, burgers aren't. I make games, by the way. I've even sold some to this diner, but they screw me out of my rightful cut. Yeah, they'll get theirs. Don't worry. I don't want to escape myself. But I know a guy who knows a guy who knows a girl who crossed using some secret tunnels at the border. Secret tunnels at the border. Good to know. I shall remember that. Not gonna lie. Change would be nice. Real nice. I just had an idea. Time to take what's mine. Come on. Okay, let's do it. Let's take what's yours, Alex. You the man. And I'm the man following the man. It's swagger, just like he is. What are we doing, Alex, huh? What are we doing? simple there's a room in the back where they keep their cash Ooh, I like cash hack in. okay exactly home slice come on home slice what I'm not bread but if I am you can Yo, call me Wanda get it Wanda bread dinosaurs. I made some sexy digicode tech one day, scientists gonna study my brain. Boom! 
Hell yeah. What I tell you? What guys? We got oh, in. Man. Door closed behind us. It's gonna re-trigger the dick. Oh, I like money. September 11th, 1986. Brigades responsible for attack. All signs point to the terroristic organization, the Black Brigades, being responsible for the heinous attack on the wall. The white truck, which caused the collapse, belonged to Connie Samford, 33, a known member of the radical organization. Now, let's look for the dough. Okay, Alex, I found dough. Here. And it smells. Ugh, oh, I can't do anything. Check the drawers. And the safe, too. <laughs> Duh. Hold up. There's an article here on the attack. Yeah, what's it say? Bodies of certain brigades believed to be at the wall were never found. No 2672, way. there's My the code. Parents might still be alive. It's written right on that paper. 2672, let's try that. At least it looks like a code. Negative, did not work. Lucky Star says 0% chance of guessing. We need Alex. Use my tech. This article is important to me for personal reasons. Okay, we just acquired hacking. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. <gasps> Look guys. We got 20 bucks. And another 20 bucks. And whoops. Oh no, I didn't grab that one. I hear someone Open. coming. Hide. And another 20 bucks. Okay, I'm trying, Alex. Let me go. Hide. Okay, don't breathe. Don't shush. move. Be hella quiet. I am gonna be hella quiet. You shush. Oh look, it's Adam the driver without the sunglasses. been in the back room lately looks different like someone's been back here yeah I'll check just give me a second bad news it's empty okay I'll sit tight uh-huh okay bye oh, no 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 hey who's in there Run! oh Alex oh no uh, just whatever you talk oh about. no how do I get out of here guys Uh, let me day, kid. get out of here before I change my mind. And he took his money back. Okay, let's get the Jesus out of here. Oh, wait, we can take a rest. Let's do that. Gotta keep the energy high. Because you don't know what's in store down the road. And now we're at June 27th, 1996. We have a full energy bar, meaning the energy bar at the top left hand corner of the screen is actually full. We do not have an actual energy bar. To like you know eat I never did find keys I wonder if there's keys to find do one more quick look see Lou around I am not spending money on a tape just some empty tires Wait, can I hack my way back in? Negative. No option. Alright, it looks like we need to leave the area now. 
Wait. Let's call a taxi. All of our taxis are currently busy. Please call again another day. What? What? You should get back on the road, kid. That's your advice? That's lame. Alright, let's hitchhike. <laughs> Bye, biggies. It's been real. And it's been fun. But it's not been real fun. Alright. 521 miles. June 27th, 1996. We have met Jared, Sonia, Stan and Mitch, Alex, Fanny, John, and Zoe between episode one and this current episode, which is two. And I know who these guys are. Stan and Mitch, oh yeah! Gonna get sick. What'd you say, kid? Can't hear ya on account of the wind. Little buddy says he won't get sick on the hog, Stan. Mitch, hard as I try, I can't hear you neither on account of the wind. Please be careful. Last kid done did break the sidecar. I see your lips are moving, and I know you are speaking to me. Yet pains me to say, I cannot hear you. <laughs> I know. On account of the wind. On account of the wind. I Mitch, heard you the first the two times. Better still be there. What if I could, Stan? Now you know I have issues with the lower lumbar. Right, your issues with the lower lumbar. Kid, check the bag in the back. Watch! A furry friend! Oh, that's too bad. Ugh, Cabin they just the ran over an animal. Like, you guys board, can't feel it, or, but I can feel it in my controller. Like what the hell's going on? Oh no, not at all. <laughs> yeah, not at all. <laughs> We did it, Mitch! We robbed the big one! First Patreon National! <laughs> That's mighty kind of you to say, kid! Hey, little buddy! You've heard of Stan and Mitch, right? I knew it, Mitch! We're famous! Woohoo! But here we are, hogging the conversation. Maybe you'd like to pose a topic of your own. Sure. Mitch and I never do that. Petria's being good to us, making us feeds and all. But I heard smugglers can help. Ooh, smugglers. That sure be something. Yeah, something. Hey, what are you looking out down there? Shucks, Mitch. Looks like we forgot a scratch. My brother and I are morally good. If you mind as the robin with firearms. But we do have a weakness for the scratch tickets. Oh no, we're getting pulled over by the popo. Oh, shoot! The cops, Stan! That's not good. If this we're goners! Kid, do something to slow him down! Uh aren't you to shoot? Okay, this is not easy. Jesus, this control is like crazy. 